2023 AFL team coach cards are finally out and today we're going to be unbreaking 17 packs of the new AFL 2023 team coach cards. It's been a long time coming to be fair, the release date sort of got postponed and um, yeah I'll be opening 17 packs in this video. I've also got 5 more packs to open later tonight on stream so make sure you join me for my live stream as well. I'll be unbo unboxing the packs and also the albums but today is all about the 17 packs we've got right here. We've got the new cards. I got them from three different boxes, but also three different cases as well. So we could be hitting some big hits in the video as well. And we'll quickly show you guys the ratios as we always do before we get into it. So it's very different this year. The cards are now $3.50 a pack. So a little bit more expensive. But that's probably because of the high quality cards that are put into the packs this season. So we have 225 commons. But you get five per pack and also eight in A4W commons. So in a box, you do not get the full set of commons like you previously used to. 225 silvers, so two per pack, unless you get a Scallons common. And you get 225 gold, one in every 12 packs. So normally they're one in every two or one in every pack. You get one in every three for the star powers for silver. For team, you get one in 36. And again, just like last year, Neon, one in four, 32. Didn't get one last year, so it'd be nice if I did this time around. The card crafts are again in the set. You've got 108 of them, one in six for the silvers, one in 864 for the gold collides. And I got to get a couple of them last year. The odd bods are also in the set, but you only get one in every 12 packs. Best and first are one in 10 for the silvers, and one in 72 now for the gold. So that's up from one in 50 last year. New cards called AFL Fantasy Favorites. They're one in every six. And one in every 72, you got AFL Fantasy Duos. There are now so many cards in the set that are of a higher rarity than a one per 36 pack card. The wild cards are also in the set. You got 18 Magic Star, Rookie, and Gallery. So they've just upped it to twice as many. One in 36 for a normal one, one in 432 for a gold. You've got the Throwback Scalen 60th Anniversary Tribute Cards. They're new. 1 in 7 for a common. 1 in 864 for a retro. And then you got the Trophy Wild Cards. 11 of them. 1 in 432 for a silver. And 1 in 10 cases for a gold. With 17 packs, you'd like to at least get a card that is 1 per box rarity. So, let's get into the first pack here. And they're of a weird... Well, they're of a paper variety. So, let's have a look at what the new cards look like. I think the specials... There in the front, so you got a Dion Prestia Silver right here, and the Dame Rampy. So these are the one in every two. Uh, so yeah, one every two in every pack. So you get two of every those in a pack, and then you got. So these are the odd bods, and I actually kind of like them. They're 3D. This is of Docker's Young Gun Hayden Young. So the special cards are at the front. Remember back in the day when you, you'd see a black line and you go, "If there's a black line, that there could be a wild card three cards in." The black lines are back. But uh, they don't mean anything really. So there's a black line. So there's there's what the commons look like. A bit of a retro design from previous years. You got the stats at the bottom, and then the Guernsey at the back as well. Um, so yeah, that's the first pack. We got a one in twelve, so not too bad. But we're not looking for the one in twelve. We're looking for the one in thirty six cards at least. What do we got here? We've got a card craft. Elliot Yo, silver. Tony Mankerba, silver. And then a Luke Parker card craft. I think I like these ones a little bit more because of the uh, the shininess and it's, it's in silver like that. So pretty cool, pretty cool stuff. Oh, there we go. There's an AFLW. Pretty much, unlike Select, it's pretty much identical to um, a normal one. So not really a different design. All right, that's two packs in. These are so much more interesting to collect now that you've got so much more of a variety. You just never know what you might pull in the packs. As we've hit a... Ooh, now this is new. This is new. Um, so Jared Witts, let's just show you guys uh, that card. And then we've got a first of the... Now, what are they called again? These are a throwback to the cards back, obviously, in like the 80s and all that. Scalin 60th Anniversary Tribute Card. So this is not what you'd expect to see um, for a regular Team Coach card um, in a Team Coach set. But it's actually a lot thicker than what I thought when I saw it the cards um, for the first time. So this is sort of a little bit of a trivia, who am I? It's much of a throwback. Like this is, this looks like an, a card you get in the 1980s, but it's a Dyson Heppel card. So that's a replacement of the silver card. So you actually get that and also a star powers. And I like this card a lot, actually. I know it's only one in every three. There's a bit of a reveal of the code. Uh, even though it's one in every three, it feels like a much rarer card than that. I, I won't lie, I like the star powers. There's a chance I might start getting sick of the star powers if we get too many. So hopefully, we don't get too many of the star powers and we get some of the good, good cards. Alright, Rory Laird, Silver. Um, Will Day, Silver. And oh, 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 oh. Thought for a second we got something good. But these gold cards, they're technically still good. Like, I'd be happy getting one of these in a pack because they're one in every 12. And this is what they look like. They're not really too dissimilar from gold cards in previous years, but I like the 
the embossed style and the other uh, shine. And then there's also a code at the back as well. Let's try and get as many varieties as we possibly can in this box. Oh, sorry, in these packs. So this is the fifth pack. And looks like another gold. So another Elliot Yo. I swear I've already gotten an Elliot Yo on Nan Kervis. And this is a great goal to get. Marcus Bonten Pelly. That is a good goal to get. He's one of the guns of the competition. I think he's the highest rated player in AFL 23. So number six. Pack number six. We need to get someone good here. I'll be a little bit annoyed. Andrew Gaff. So it's something with the West Coast Silvers that we keep getting. Ben Brown and a Star Powers. Now, I'm not sure if this is a Team Star Powers or not. I can't really tell. I guess it's just because the design looks so cool. It feels like it's one of them, but it's not. It's just a normal one. Noah Anderson. I was yet to... I was never able to get a Neon Star Power back in the... Um, oh, Jesus. What's with all these Elliot Yo cards? This is a joke. So if you get an Elliot Yo at the front, you're going to get a Toby Nan Curvis. Who the hell wants an Elliot Yo and Toby Nan? You've already seen him. I don't care if it's not focusing. So as Nick would say, a nice Richmond pack there. You've got a Star Powers as well of uh, Jaden Short, but not not great. Can we just stop getting the Nan Curvises and Yo's? Because I swear we've gotten them at least three times in seven packs. It's not very good luck. I'm going to definitely get sick of these silvers. I'm going to get heaps of them. Ben Ainsworth and another gold. That's three gold. So we're doing well with the golds. Brennan Parfit for the Cats. It would be nice if we got a Saints gold. As of course I do go for the Saints. Alrighty, what do we have here? We've got Mitch Giordiades. Jacob Wiedering. And a... Well, there we go. Here we go. A St. Kilda car. That's our first St. Kilda here of the day. And it's a Star Powers of Brad Crouch. How cool does that look? Alrighty, we're almost halfway through these packs. And we're still yet to get anything good. Our best hit has been a gold card, but we want to hit something better than that. As we've hit a Tim Taranto, Sam Collins, and... Oh, yes! Oh, my goodness! Look what we've got here. We've gotten our first big hit, and we've got a Star Wild of Darcy Wilmot. These are the rookie cards. So, as you can look here, that is pretty cool. And you've also got the back designed by Grange Wallace. It does say RW, so I'd be of the belief that this is just a regular one. Yeah, it's not gold. So this would just be a 1 in 36, but it's still a very, very nice card. I really like the design of the background as well with the uh, the team colors. So we've hit and big. I'm happy. If we if we can just... If, if we just get a Star Wild, I'm happy with that. But let, let's try and go one better than that. Let, let's try and get a second one. There's a chance we can get a second one. All right, here we've got Zach Merritt. Sean Darcy. Oh, we've gotten two Rising Star Wild cards in a row. We've gotten two Rising Star wildcards in a row. Sam Darcy and Darcy Wilmot. I have never done that before. I have in previous breaks before, but I've never gotten two wildcards in a row. How bloody cool is that? Sam Darcy. As I said before, we, we got them from separate boxes, separate cases. So there was a chance of something like that happening. And we've just gone bang, bang. Can we go bang, bang, bang? This is for like a turkey or a hat trick. A hat trick in cricket. Here we go. Opening up the pack. What do we get here? This is all... This is massive. Cam Rayner. Jack Sinclair. Oh, we got a gold best and fairest. That's a hat-trick of wild cards. A hat-trick of box cards. We've just gotten three box cards in a row. Can you believe that? A Richmond best and fairest in gold. This is the gold variety. One in every 72. And as you can see, there is a code in the background. That's what it looks like. What in the world? Three box cards in a row. That is wild. That is wild. We've just got the hat trick. Surely not. Surely not a double hat trick. If this week, if we get four wild cards or four box cards in a row, I would, I don't know what I'd do. Surely not. Harry Himmelberg. Tom Barras. Oh, I thought for a second we've got our first of the AFL fantasy favourites in um, Jordan Dawson. Well, I wish we had more than what we have now, but that's all right. I think we've already beat the odds. I've done better than opening a box, and I've still got four packs to go and five on the stream. So watch the stream, guys, later tonight. Colton v Geelong. That should be a classic of a game. Ben Mackay, Bradley Hill. And we've got no star powers of Jack Crisp. These cards are looking nice though, but it's no team star powers. But yeah, what are the chances we get two rising star star wilds? Not even just stars, but rising star varieties. Rising star wilds, I guess you could call them. Alrighty, what do we have here? Caleb Daniel. K 
Callum Wilkie. Oh, he's got a footy card. That's pretty cool. And a Paddy Cripps. Beat this guy in a goal kicking challenge. There you go. So two more packs to go. I'm feeling like we could get something. Three box hits in a row. Like, that's just... I don't know. That's pretty crazy, to be honest. Never had something like that happen before. Cam Rayner. Jack Sinclair. And a silver. Oh, imagine. Imagine. A silver card craft of Gus Brayshaw. These cards are going to be fun to collect. Let me tell you for a fact, they will be fun to collect. Whilst they are slightly pricier, you get heaps more variety, heaps more chance of getting the big box hits that you always want to be hitting. So, oh, look at this. We got our uh, first of the Scallons. Is this a rare one? It's silver. Scallon 60th anniversary, common in 1 in 7, retro 1 in 8, 6, 4. You wouldn't think this is a retro. I'm not sure. You'd think it'd look a little bit cooler that it, uh, than if it was a retro. I think this is the common, but in a silver background. Um, and then you've got an Adam Chera silver, so just the one silver there. And then an Alex Witherdam of the AFL Fantasy variety. As you can see at the back, you've got the stats for Fantasy, which I think is quite cool as well. However, that is it for the first break of the 2023 footy card season for the Team Coach cards. And in the first 17 packs of the season, we hit three box hits, but all in a row. Like, you can't script that. Darcy Wilmot star, Sam Darcy star, Richmond Best and Fairest. How awesome is this? We'll be doing more pack breaks throughout the year and also on my second channel. We're also really close to 25,000 subscribers. So when I do hit the milestone, we're going to be giving away a fresh unopened box of AFL Team Coach. So if you're yet to subscribe and you're enjoying these sort of videos and want to be in with a chance of winning, now is a great time to subscribe. But regardless, we'll wrap it up there. That was an awesome start to the cards. Can't wait to crack open some more cards throughout the year. We'll see you soon in my next video. Cheers.